According to reports, Delta State Governor Mr. Ifanya Ukoa was robbed by daredevil armed robbers right inside the government house in Delta State. Secret reporters report that the incident happened May 28, 2020 and will forever remain a bad memory in the heart of the governor because the incident occurred despite the numerous security agents spread all over the state government house. It was gathered that while Okowa slept that night and his security men patrol the Dennis Osadebe house where destinies of men are decided. Armed robbers which other sources claimed were probably hired assassins were busy robbing the governor's family which was under lock in the guest house section. Insiders within the government house told secret reporters that the heavily armed men did not break through the wall of government house to gain entrance into the place. Instead, they were able to assess the guest house section by breaking through the window where they had a field day. With this robbery right inside government house, some security experts blame it on the new chief security officer, Mr. Efuzomo, who picks tribalism over competence. According to the source, he posts out security officials and bring in mainly Delta North officers to work with him. He also revealed that Efuzomo is not liked by those working with him and that's that they pray every day for the governor to remove him but to no avail as Okowa does not have the courage to do so owing to the fact that they are both from the same Ika clan and also if Yuzomo is a son of the king Okowa will be the first governor in Delta state history to be in power when armed robbers invaded the government house Government house officials have been ordered to keep the robbery top secret while an investigation is carried out, as making it public will bring embarrassment to the governor, especially since he has spent so much money on security in the state, only to have the most secured place in the state brazenly robbed at night. Okay? Since they don't want this kind of a thing to come up, of course, maybe somehow, somehow during investigation, this information has been able to, uh, you know, reach out to the public because that is what we are hearing. Because normally it would have been, uh, to have been an headline since it happened. Today is what today is a thirty first, like almost three days back. So of course they will try to hide it because it's really, <laughs> it's really embarrassing if anyone should hear or. Hearing this is really embarrassing. That's why they are keeping it. But no matter what, it will see comments. That is what, and that is why we are hearing this at this particular time. Hmm. Like they always say, that one that shall never end. Only God knows what happened. And of course, a lot of things. Let them do their investigation. It's it's, it's not going to be possible for just a an outside uh, armed robber to just come in without knowing what has been going on and not having a kind of a information concerning that uh, the government as nobody can just go there with all the heavily secured uh, security all over the place something is really fishing like when they do their investigation they will see that uh, there was a loophole for somebody or maybe an information has been leaked out on how to penetrate and do whatever they want to do so whether it is a as a result of a nepotism bringing people it is inconsequential but what is what matters now is that it's not supposed to happen and it has happened if the government house that uh, supposed to be secured is not secured then what do you have to say to people who are who do not even have security people ordinary nigerians or ordinary, ordinary debtors who do not have security how do you expect them to be confident that yet things can really happen of course again people might not want to even liken it to this estimate if a government house something of such will happen then it's a free fall to People who want to commit a or perpetrate a, their evil. So let's hear what people are saying. Of course, you know, definitely the people must say something. People must definitely say something. Someone says, if armed robbers can face and concentrate on political robbers, things will change for good. Okay, this person is seeing it from a different angle entirely. Uh, Miss of siphoning the state phone 
how can robbers get access to government house and go scot free shame as somebody is believe is thinking that or is not believing this story that they are looking for a way to siphon government money someone said hmm, uh god bless you for saying that my take exactly of course a lot of people are agreeing to that that uh, how can because it's unheard of and that's why they don't want to make it public that a government house that's supposed to be well secured and people just go in and just rob and come out. What are we talking about? You know, some people knowing fully well that all the antics that they say politicians do play might not want to buy into this. Someone say all the security men on duty should be arrested. The robbers are insider security agents who were bent to rubbish the CS CSO to be removed. Okay. Governor Kowa must change his security arrangements. This is to close for comfort. This is too close for comfort. This is an in-house. The next step will be his death. A stitch in time save nine. Watch your back very close and overhaul all your security now or you will, you might regret your action. I disagree with this. I cannot be allowed to continue. It was an inside the I bet you. If it is true, then it's within them. They should investigate the security men and the police. Thank God you are alive with your family, okay? God will frustrate the devices of your enemies so their hands will not perform their enterprise in your life and in the life of your family, okay? They know what they are doing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nigerians will not want to be food. Nigerians will not want to just take anything just like that. Story for the gods, all na lie, make una live political stories. If you have been to government house before, you will know it will be difficult for any armed robbers to go in inside job, go and go and add because it's made up of different security. Hmm, someone is laughing. That shows how he's so weak and useless when it comes to security matters in data state, a state where Esme have a fide humiliating the citizens without governor saying nothing exactly just like i said <laughs> people will want to liken it to the yes men situation in the state this shows that the security belongs to god and government of governor kowa has no security imagine a state with lots of fulani esme i talk her now it's clear that nobody is safe in this state everybody is living on your own mm. may god help us the cso is incompetent and should be removed Immediate removal of the CSO. Can this be true? If yes, then we are in trouble. He's lucky they would have killed him just like that. That is to say, nowhere is secured in Delta State. And that is why SMA gain access to your land on repel. A governor without security, how fit is he to secure the state? Shame on you and learn from Wiki. Okay. Sounds is a setup. CSO. COS, I mean CSO, incompetent. Never, not everything you play politics with. This can only happen in data state. Well, it is a good eye opener to the governor if he's really ready to set the security apparatus in data state rights. That is a sad commentary to let the public know about it. With this, the poor masses are not safe in the state. One day, S men will kidnap data state governor if this story is true. Now, so, story, 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 APC and PDP, now the same. It's a planned work from the government house. <laughs> because everybody will just, be, how, how can that be? If it is not an insider that, 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 that planned it, or if not a, this thing, nobody will want to just take that as well. That's, issue, that's to tell you that the, the, the security is very, very weak. Just like I said, what people will just be thinking is the, the way S may have, have really been having having it so easily in that state unless maybe they are they are telling us what we do need to know and that's why the thing is did not just come out i think because of the investigation that's why people are just trying to get are trying to get that now if not ah this thing should have been first thing even the day it really happened you can see what a common man uh is passing through with his mopo dss see bad boys came in it's Better to employ those bad boys. It's obvious. Please stop that expensive joke. Where were all the security details? It simply means they were responsible for the robbery. For the robbery. Period. 
hey wonder shall never end thieves in the state who knows ma naidi kilamu hmm. very good thanks you ambroba okay i hope it is not a foul play that the admit is tribal people to give his protection niger can be funny are there no cctv within the government house that's a big question if this is true data citizens are not safe we are doomed in this case nobody is immune to robbery attacks in nigeria where were his security men good question they say they are doing investigation uh we'll get to know this at the end of the day so guys let's say your opinion leave your comments and let's have your seat thank you